Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So we are in April and it is my birthday on Monday and I can't wait. I thought I would do a little bit of a like a dress going out haul. I know um, <laughs> there's not much that we can do at the minute but why not dress up at home. It's been a while since I've had a good dress up and just pampering myself and just like getting myself looking nice and um, wearing some nice clothes I guess. So I thought why not. So I have done a haul from a couple of different shops so I've done Pretty Little Thing, uh, Opoly and also ASOS and I've tried to get a couple of different ones and some to be honest are a bit out of my comfort zone but we'll try them and we'll see but the purpose of this video was I wanted to try on a couple of different dresses and get you guys opinion and See what you think was the best and which you would like me to wear for my birthday. So you've got two days, well, a day and a half to pick. Okay, so this is the first one and it's a black dress from River Island. Well, from ASOS, but it's River Island. Um, it's a bit big on the top, but I always have that problem. Um, and it's got this little um, waist belt detail, if you can see, and then all this like ruched fabric at the top, which I think is like a really luxurious detail. It just really makes it look classy and expensive. And it also has this split here, which is probably the only thing I'm not keen on, just because um, I do have a big bum, it is pulling it. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it is pulling it here a bit. Um, but other than that, I do really like this one, which is such a shame. I do think it looks really classy and really elegant. It's such a shame and as well the belt doesn't have a buckle on so I think that that might be a bit annoying um, whether I have to put like an elastic band on there or something just to keep it in place or like a safety pin but I feel like that's just going to keep like pulling um, which will be really annoying. Um, excuse excuse my belly at the minute I am so so bloated. I swear I always do these videos when it's the time of the month but I literally cannot help it. Um, I cannot help it this month. I was so tempted not to do this video because I was just feeling a bit crap. I thought, you know what, just do it, get on with it. So this one is actually 55 pounds and it is reduced to 18 pounds 70, which I think is an incredible saving. If it didn't have this split, I think it would probably be a very very high contender for me but it's just that that's throwing me off but I don't know what a good fucking camera I've not got my contact lenses in so let me know what you guys think so next we've got this number from ASOS and I picked this one up because I wanted to get something a little bit glitzy um but oh I don't know I'm not sure I like the idea of it but I'm just not so sure when it's on I don't know Part of me feels like I should be in ABBA or something. Yeah, there's just something about it and I can't quite pinpoint it. But it's really comfy, I will say that. It is really, really comfortable. A lot more comfortable than the last one. Um, I would feel comfortable wearing this and even just like lounging around the house is that comfy. I don't know, I think it's growing on me. I do quite like these like cuff details and then it's got like the high neck here. Um, so I do like the cut of it, but whether, I like the idea of it, whether it's executed how I would like it, I don't know. I like how the sleeves are kind of semi-sheer, so they haven't like got a lining in them, so you can kind of see through them, but I don't think it'll be my favourite when I try the other ones on, so let's carry on so next up we have this dress from asos and i love the detailing here i think this is stunning so i don't know if you can see there's a little um like slip dress underneath and then there's this ruching here and then these long like balloon sleeves that cuff in weird little buttons and then it has a little tie waist and then it has all this fabric in the skirt i think this is so flattering and stunning I really, really love this one. And if I show you the back as well, it has like an open sort of cowl back. The only thing I will say is it's very short. Um, like if the slightest movement, I'm 
showing my bum basically so i think i probably have to wear like some kind of shorts or something underneath um because it is riding up very easily so this one was 45 pounds it wasn't in the sale it's a full price but um i just love this little skirt with like all these little pleats in I think it's really flattering. These kind of silhouettes do suit my figure. The only thing I will say is I wanted probably something a bit more, I don't know. This feels a bit more like casual. Well, not casual, it just feels a bit more modest. <laughs> I was wanting something a bit more like bam, if you know what I mean something a bit more dramatic. So next up, I've got this leopard print dress and this is the one that Gavin wanted to put in the basket. And to be honest, I wasn't sure. They did it in a snake print, which is the one I preferred, but it was sold out of my size. So I had to go for the leopard print. And I wasn't that sure, but when it's on, I'm actually not mad at it. It actually looks quite nice and it is quite flattering. Um, I probably would change to the snake print one. I do feel a bit like Wilma Flintstone slash Destiny's Child Survivor in this, but I do think it's flattering. I do think it's nice. So it's like this lacy um, netting, I should say, um, that's really stretchy and then has another layer underneath. And there's some like ruching with a little tie. And then it has this like net little frill at the bottom just to finish it off but I'm not mad at it. It is super comfy. I will say that it is really, really comfy. It's really stretchy um, and doesn't feel like restrictive or anything. So next up, we've got this ASOS premium dress and it was reduced from 95 pounds to 21.90, which I thought was an absolute steal. But um, I will be honest, um, ASOS fit assistant is failing me because I could at least go down two sizes in this. It is pretty big, um, but I do really like it, um, which is such a shame. I love this color. It's called a smoke, but it's like this gray lilac. It's just really, really stunning and really beautiful. So this thing, I was a bit unsure as to how it went. Um, I've just looked at the model and this is how she is wearing it. But when I initially put it on, I thought it went over like this arm. Um, I guess you can kind of do what you want with it. Um, I'm going to put it back to how they had it. But um, I do think this is such a shame. I think it's a really stunning dress. So we've also got this like little drape piece here as well on this shoulder. And um, it comes in at the waist, is draped round and it's has again this thigh split but the good thing about this one is it's like crossing fabric so I don't have the same issue that I did with the River Island dress um, and then this side you can't see my feet but this side actually comes straight to the floor it actually drags on the floor it's so long and it like tapers to one side um, and then this side kind of just like pulls round and meets it um, but yeah, again, this is super comfortable. I really like it. It's just such a shame that it is too big. I'm really gutted. It is a bit extra though, maybe a bit too extra for a birthday party at home. Who am I kidding? Like, I can wear what I want. <laughs> I do feel a bit like Warrior Princess, like, I don't know, Helen of Troy or like, what's her name? Megara from Hercules. <laughs> No chance, no way, I won't say no, no. Do, 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 do. Right. <gasps> Don't judge me um, if you stood there thinking I look like a highlighter pen. I was not expecting it to be this bright. I have some shoes from ASOS and they are the colour Chartreuse. I think that's how you say it. I bought them years ago and I really love them and I saw this and it was listed as chartreuse so I thought they will match my shoes I'll give it a go um it's a lot brighter than I was expecting although I've just pulled out my shoes and they do match ASOS is right it is chartreuse I don't know what I was expecting but um I don't know I just wasn't expecting it to be this bright having said that I quite like it I'm not one for neon colours, like if anyone knows me, I hate neon, but I kind of love it. Um, the more I look at it, I really like it. 
I don't know, if they did it in like a black version, I'd maybe be more swayed to that. But, oh, this is throwing me. I did not expect to like it. It's quite nice. Um, so it just comes just above the knee and is like a standard bandeau dress. And then it's got these gold detailing here. The only thing is I'm a small bastard. So without a bra, I'd literally be flat. <laughs> these would probably just, you probably just see my boobs right through these. Um, so I think I'd have to leave this skin colored bra on, but I don't think it's an issue with it. I don't think you can really tell actually, but let me know what you guys think. This was an oddball. When I opened it, I was like, no way, but I don't know. This is a strong contender so far. I quite like this. This is kind of what I was looking for. So I really liked the blue one, but this one's a bit more like, a bit more like a party dress, I guess. Next up, we've got this a top and skirt set from Pretty Little Thing. And I saw this in, I think it was a mailer that went out and I was like, oh, I love that. They do it in a couple of different colors. The pink one's also quite nice and they do have like a blue and green and like browns, I think, which look really nice as well. But I thought I'd go with this color, something a bit different. And I'm in love. I think it's really, really flattering and really stunning. The only thing about it for me is it's quite summery. It looks like the kind of dress that, that you would wear when you are on holiday. Not really for now when it's practically still winter and freezing cold. Um, oh, that's a shame. I do really like this. Um, I probably will end up keeping this for summer, but for my birthday, I don't know. What do you guys think? Can I get away with it now? Or do you think that it is too summery for now? Um, it's the same with the other one, I guess. The bright color, it looked quite summery. I'm not really spring-esque. I think I'm just like dying for summer. I got a bit carried away and was like, oh, let's buy all these summery outfits. But I will say it is super comfortable. It's really flattering. The fact that you have these ruching here, um, even though that I'm like really bloated right now, it's concealing that and you cannot see it. So this is a really good one. I feel really comfortable in it. It's only the fact that it's a little bit summery that's doing it for me but um, I'll just show you around the other side. So um, I like the fact that it's a top and a skirt set as well. I think that you could just like wear the skirt, like you could chuck the skirt on over the top of like your swimming costume on holiday. Like if you're like sunbathing or something, you're like quick nipping out to the shops or something, you can just shove this on and it looks like an outfit. And equally with the top, you could pair it like with some, I don't know, leggings or trousers or something. And next we've got this goldy slash champagne color, I wanna say. Um, it is more champagne than gold. Um, it's a bit more of like a bronzy gold number from ASOS and this was 45 pounds. Um, it has got pretty high slits. I'll be careful not to flash you. <laughs> um, but I do really love the addition of this belt. I do think with the like draped style dress, this addition just like cinches you in at the waist and I think it's really flattering. Um, the only thing I will say is when I tried it on yesterday I felt like I needed a tighter buckle but with me being blue <laughs> today um, it feels enough but I think like every day when I wear it I probably would need a tighter belt is just Today, I don't, but I think it's really, really flattering. Again, it's super, super comfortable. So it has this kind of like a V dip at the back. The only thing is I probably wouldn't be able to wear a bra, which I kind of need because I am pretty flat chested. So I'd either have to pull my bra down or I'm not wearing one of the stick on bras because I just hate those, they always fall off. I have had to do the straps up quite tight because it does feel like it's like gaping here a bit, like it's a bit too big. Um, but it definitely feels like it fits here. I mean, any tighter, I'd definitely be flashing everyone. Next, we've got this dress, which is from Opoly, and this was 60 pounds. Um, and I do think it's really flattering. They do it in a couple of different colors. They have it in white and like a nudie, rosy pink. 
Um, I went for the black. Um, I did actually want the white, but the white was sold out in my size, so I went for the black. But I do really like these like balloon sleeves. I'm just not sure if it's me so much. I do really like this like neckline though, so I don't know. Um, I think it's definitely made for someone with a bigger bust. But having said that, I do think it is really flattering. I think this is the sort of dress that will flatter most people, and especially if you're like self-conscious of your arms, they are well. Yeah, I think it's pretty. I don't know if I feel super special in it, if you know what I mean. Second to last, we have this dress from Opoly, and I wasn't too sure on the website, but now I've got it on, I really love it. Um, I was a bit like, oh, are these sleeves going to be a bit too, like, out there, a bit extra, but I'm here for it. <laughs> I really like them, and I think this dress is so flattering. So you have, like, all this ruching detail here, and then it's, like, a flat panel down this one side, and then you have these, which are, like, super padded, puffy, like, Tudor sleeves, and they actually, like come all the way under as well. This might be my favorite so far. I just think it's one of those dresses that other girls will appreciate. You, you know when you look at a girl's dress and you're like, wow, her dress like looks stunning. It's really beautiful. I think this is probably one of those dresses. I think it's gonna be a bit of a Marmite dress. Like you either love it or you hate it, but uh, I really like this. And finally, I've got this top from Opoly. So they do this also in a dress version and it's in this gorgeous coppery colour and also gold. And I really wanted it, but it was sold out in my size, which is typical. And I waited a couple of days to see if it was gonna come back in stock and it wasn't. So I went and bought the top, um, which I do actually quite like. So it's got these like diamante details. I've left the plastic on. It's got these like diamante detail straps, but they are adjustable, which I think is really good. And then it's got this like busted corset. I can show you. <laughs> and then it has this piece of fabric here, which has like a draping detail. And then it comes into a point at the front. I've just thrown on some leather leggings. I've not, I've not styled this up and tried it on before now to see um, what options that it works with. I just chucked these on just to show you. I do like it, although I'm not 100% sure. I do feel like it's a bit short. I don't know, maybe it's me. If it was a dress, I think I would really love it. I do really love this color though. I think it's a stunning color. I need to add more of this to my wardrobe. And I'll show you the back, it just like zips up at the back. Um, it is quite a like short back. Um, so if you did wanna wear a bra underneath, I mean, feeling mine is okay. It is covered, but it is quite short. So that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I really don't know, I cannot pick. I do really like a lot of them. I think I'm just gonna have to leave it down to you guys. Let me know in the comments below which one you like best, which one um, you think I should wear for my birthday. You've got until Monday, so don't take too long. Let me know which one you like best and I will keep that and wear it on my birthday on Monday. And if you're new here, please hit the subscribe button below and don't forget to hit the notification bell if you want to know when the latest videos are coming out. I do post on a Monday and a Thursday, but it's a little bit different this week due to me waiting for these items to be delivered. But yeah, stay safe and I will see you soon. Bye.